Now I know I haven't covered word problems in a long time, but um, I'm going to continue an entire series on these, and I'm going to go ahead and read you another one here, and this will help you start building your word problem skills. One of the things about calculus is that you're going to have a whole bunch of word problems, and the more you learn from me, the better off you're going to be later on. Let me read you a typical word problem. Now this is kind of a very uh, early stage type word problem, whereas some of the things that I'll talk about later will be a little more complicated. But anyway, we have a guy named Alex, and he gets motivated to go to a museum. Now, when I say a nearby museum, I mean something that's not like 60 or 70 miles away. Obviously, if you have a museum that's 70 miles away, that's not very close. But in this case, he lives just 15 miles away from a very big museum. So Alex climbs in his car and he decides to go to that museum. And he drives 15 miles and gets there. Well, he enjoys the museum. He takes a look at all the exhibits and whatever. And uh, he has a little notepad. He takes notes, whatever. And then uh, afterwards, he climbs back in the car. Well, he's kind of tired, and he doesn't want to drive 15 miles all the way back home, so he decides, you know what, let's just uh, pull out my little uh, iPhone, and he pulls out his iPhone, he uh, hits the uh, uh, one of the map things on, on the iPhone, and he discovers that there's a route that he can take that is shorter than the route he took to get to the museum, okay? So... What he does, he figures this whole thing out, and he ends up driving 10 miles back home, whereas when he went to the museum itself, he drove 15 miles. That's because he pretty much took the wrong route. Okay? So anyway, he's driven 15 miles to this museum, and he drives 10 miles back home. Well, what we're wanting to know is how many miles did Alex drive that day? Well... You take the 15 miles that he drove to the museum, and then you add the 10 miles that he drove all the way back, and what you'll get is 15 plus 10 equaling 25. I'll get that a little closer. 15 plus 10 equals 25. And that's how many miles he actually drove that entire day. And that's how you solve that word problem. All right. I will tell you more in a future video, so stay tuned.